This short tutorial will outline the steps you will need to take to register online for your courses. The first step is to find the CRN, or course registration number, for each course you are planning to take. Start at the College of St. Scholastica homepage, www.css.edu. Scroll to the bottom of the page and click the Current Student Backpack icon. On the next screen, under Top Tools, click on Course Schedule. On this screen, you are asked to fill in several fields. First, select the term for which you will be registering from the drop-down menu. Next, choose a home campus. If you are unsure of your home campus, click the What is my home campus link for further information. Finally, choose a course type, undergraduate or graduate. Then click Continue. The next window will give you a list of courses available. Depending on your home campus, you may see some classes that are offered online and some that are offered in person. Options at the top of the page allow you to further refine your search. Scroll through the list of courses to find those you are planning to take. You'll see that you can view the number of open seats in each course as well as instructor names. The information you'll need to have when you register in BannerWeb is the CRN. This is listed in the left column under the section number. Be sure to take note of the CRNs for the courses for which you are planning to register, as you'll need to enter this information into BannerWeb. Once you have consulted your advisor and have your CRNs, you are ready to register. On the St. Scholastica homepage, hover over the Logins link at the top of the page. This will open a drop-down menu. Click on the first link, BannerWeb. On the Banner Web login page, the first thing you will need to do is enter your user ID. This is your nine-digit student ID number beginning with a capital letter B or V. Next, enter your PIN number. This is not your alternate PIN, which will be used later in the registration process. If you have not logged into BannerWeb before, your default PIN is your six-digit birth date in month, day, year format. If it is your first visit to BannerWeb, you will be asked to choose a new PIN number. The PIN can only contain numbers. No letters, dashes, or symbols are allowed. You will need to remember your PIN number for future access to BannerWeb. Once you have entered your user ID and PIN, click the Login button. You should now be at the main menu page. Click on Student Services and Financial Aid. Next, click on Registration. On the Registration screen, choose Add Drop Classes. Next, select the term for which you would like to register. Remember, you will be registering for two eight-week terms at once. Two eight-week terms are considered one semester in BannerWeb. Once you have selected the appropriate term, click Submit. On the next screen, you will be asked to enter your alternate PIN number. For accelerated degree evening program students, the alternate PIN is always six ones, or 111111. Enter the alternate PIN and click the Submit button. You are now on the Add Drop Classes screen. Near the bottom of the screen, you will see several blank boxes. This is where you will enter the CRNs for your courses. In each box, type a CRN for a course for which you wish to register. Again, be sure to enter CRNs for both eight-week terms in the semester for which you are registering. For example, for spring semester, be sure to register for courses in both Spring Term 1 and Spring Term 2. Once you have entered all of your CRNs, click the Submit Changes button. A page will come up confirming your registration. You may wish to print this page for your records. When you are done viewing your courses, be sure to click Exit to end your Banner Web session. Congratulations! You have completed the online course registration process.